two words, body cam. You know the drill, you guys are loving this content, so I am providing. However, I am going to provide a trigger warning. Some of these might be funny and they also might be very sensitive subjects. So I'm putting it out there just in case because I react live to these. I don't know what we're gonna see. Why do you want to F the police, huh? Why you say it and then you think it's gonna make you a badass or something no, in front sir, of everybody? No, sir, I don't. You wanna f the police? No, well, here I am, right I here, brother. I don't want to. Why not? You're a tough guy, come on. I'm not tough. Huh? I'm not tough. You seem like a little baby the day you was in court, remember? Yes, sir. I'm giving you every opportunity yes, to f me up. You understand? Yes, sir. Well, this just seems unnecessary, to be honest. I have seen part of this full video on TikTok, not this exact part. And in the comments, people were like, this cop actually got fired after this video went viral. And then other people were like, no, he didn't get fired, he got in trouble. So I really don't know what ended up happening, but it went viral and uh, people saw and people were not happy with it. But you guys will tell me your feelings and opinions in the comments because you always do. Hello, how are you? Good, how are you? Oh, oh Jesus. The craziest thing you're not gonna believe. What happened? So we got a call, somebody's concerned. Are you with like a hairstylist? No. Sorry, my breath's going to get your I can't tell you. Okay. My breath. Like hair and hair. Oh my Jesus. Someone's like. Oh, that's my weave. Oh, hold on. That's my wig. Hold on. <laughs> You're kidding. You're kidding. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta come see it though. Oh, please oh show Jesus. us. I got you gotta see it though. Oh, Jesus. No. <gasps> oh my god. Those officers are probably like, I'm so glad I came to work today. <laughs> Her wig. Honestly though, like let's be for real. With all the true crime documentaries out there today and everything going on in this world, if I saw that, I'm calling the police, 100%. Like, I would just say like, I don't know. It could just be hair. It could be a prop. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's a prank. I'm not sure, but I just think someone should freaking check it out. Better safe than sorry. <laughs> what a story to tell. I am so happy this all got caught on camera. He's crying. Dude? Come on. What did he do that for? Come on. Oh. Here, I'm Hop in this car. Hop in this car. Hop in. Oh, he's having a really hard time. Dude, what the f***? Did you discharge? Yeah! Dude! Yeah, I'll get it. This is so sad. 20, go ahead. You're right, brother. Dude, what the f***, man? You did what you had to do. What the f*** did he do that Three for? Minutes, yeah, Take some deep breath, brother. <sighs> Dude. <laughs> well, I was not expecting that to go from the wig clip to something as heavy as this. We don't know the situation for what exactly happened, but this just felt like the most human moment I've seen in a very long time from like police body cam footage. Like I know everyone has 
opinions about police and their power and their abuse of power and everything like that but this moment just felt so human of someone having to take a life to protect their own <sighs> what a heavy moment i can't even imagine i literally cannot imagine you don't see that a lot you don't see the emotion and the behind the scenes of a moment like that and cry i don't want to cry i don't want to cry oh i don't want this video to make me cry How you doing? You alright? Come here real quick. Just turn around real quick. I'll explain. You're not in any trouble. What the heck? Come to the back. Ma, he's just chilling with a soccer ball on his phone? What did he do? I want to know what he did. That's done. That's done. What oh my god, that's a lot of officers. No, we, We're going we, to explain. Can you take a minute, listen? Someone in your name called. Hear me out. You ready? What did I do, bro? I see like six or seven. He's trying to explain to Yeah, we're going to explain to So, hey. I got you. Oh, bro. Oh, my God, bro. I swear I didn't do nothing, bro. Chill. I didn't do I didn't do We are going to explain. Oh, my God. You're not scared if you live. You have ears, right? I'm not listening. I didn't do Oh, he's really scared. Someone called the 911 center and said, with your name, that you wanted to hurt your family and hurt yourself. So, we came, we came to make sure you're okay. All right, just listen to me. Okay. I am a popular streamer. I am a YouTuber, okay? okay. Come on. I have 10 Let me talk. So guess what? Okay, okay, okay. If you're wait. good, you may be out of these cuffs, but okay. relax. Okay. We're on your side. Right. We're here to make sure you're not going to harm yourself. Um, right? All right. Now, this people dox people, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All okay, right, so look, maybe that's let it. Let me talk. Let me talk, okay? I am a popular streamer. I have 10 million subs. You know what a streamer is, right? Uh, sure, I guess. You, you know what a streamer is? Yeah, you, you ever heard of a, of a streamer swat or whatever? Yeah. Okay. You got it? Mm -hmm. Hold this one. Yeah. Oh. Okay, so tell us about the streamer. What'd you say? What'd I didn't say? do nothing. Were you trying to be funny? No, I didn't do nothing. Well, apparently someone called a help center out in Iowa and said, Hi, and I want to help myself, my family. No, he's but lying. It's, it's, just hear it's me obviously out. a lie. It's a lie. Well, okay? we, we're here to make sure, right? Oh, yes. Because of school things, right? Yes. Be on right. my side. Yeah. Work with me. Yeah, I, yeah. Right, I imagine, imagine if like, you I have just, a son. I just hear never... me up. Imagine you have a son, you love him so much, and then someone calls your house and says, My son's... They said you have a... Bear. Want to shoot oh, oh, that's, all right, well, let's put you in the car and then guess what? Oh, I, I, all right, this is just this is just a calm, yeah, like I'm trying to calm down, oh, yeah. but it's, it's like it's a, woman, right? yeah, it's just a streamer slot. It's a streamer slot, you think, uh, yes, 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 this is streamer slot. They call somebody a streamer, what I know, I know it, yeah, exactly, exactly. I just told him that. Was this like a really bad prank or someone just called to like get him in trouble yeah, or something? I, I keep telling, I'm a We're just YouTuber. trying to figure it out right now. Yeah, I, I mean, it's not really that much to. Exactly. This is prank talking. That would be terrifying if someone just called and they're like, oh, really Jocelyn Bedard said God, this and then police show up at my house and right, put me in handcuffs. Twitch, Twitch, YouTube, yeah, no, yeah. I'm talking about. I mean, you know, I'm famous, you know, and I'm popular, you know. And. and they're probably upset, jealous, or something like He's that. He's famous and popular. I don't recognize him. Common trolls. Well, this was. Uh, oh, mm, I know, but it's a, a troll. troll. I, that's why we got to do our job. I've never been in the cup yeah. in my life, man. Oh, sure you don't have anything on it. Oh, I'm, 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 I'm straight. What the? I know. I, we just got to do our job. A troll did that? A troll called that in and caused all of this? If that's what really happened, that is wild. Like, that is taking hater and trolling to a whole other level. I know, listen to me, listen to me. I'm trying to you not We are, but you're not listening to me. These calls happen all the time. It just probably doesn't happen in Cincinnati because it's not that much famous people in Cincinnati. Is it just people that are watching your stream that are calling in? watching my stream that they're, they're trolling. But how do they know where you live? 
Oh, I'm like so confused. So a troll called, they showed up. How did they know where he lived? Why did they just immediately put him in handcuffs? Like I get what they're saying. If they think he's going to harm someone, they're gonna put him in handcuffs, but he wasn't under arrest for anything. So oh, I'm just so, I need more details. You know what? I bet, I bet I could look this up. <gasps> Found it. I show speed is the streamer. I show speed swatted and handcuffed during live stream. Popular YouTuber was in the middle of a live stream when he was swatted with law, law enforcement officers showing up at his home. So he was streaming during that? Oh my God. The stream was shut down during it. Oh, okay. So he literally said that someone called it in, he was swatted and stuff like that. So, and that he was traumatized from it. So that's what happened. I guess the troll called that in or something. Ma, people will go to lengths. That is so scary. How it should be? Hey, what's going on? Good morning. All right, I'm Officer Mike. I pulled you over because you were speeding, okay? I'm sorry, Mike. All right, sure. You have your driver's license and proof of insurance? Yes, I do. Oh, good. Now, before we uh, go on ahead and begin, let me ask you this question. Are you carrying a concealed firearm? Yes, I am. Okay, good. You have your concealed carry license? Yes, I do. All right, mm -hmm. where are your identification documents at? Located around my neck. Okay, good. Go on ahead and get them. Is this a demonstration or is this a real thing? Thank you very, very much. I do. I appreciate it. Go on and put your, return your hands back to the stairwell. All right, don't move. All right, uh, where's your firearm at? It's located on the right side of my head. Okay, good. I'm just going to ask that you go on ahead and keep it there, okay? Yes, sir. All right, nothing to worry about, nothing to be afraid about, anything like that. You'll be fine, okay? I'm going to go ahead and check out these identification uh, cards, and I'll be right back in a minute, okay? Sounds good. All right, cool. I'm curious to know if you think that this is how it should be. Like if we should have some form of like when you do your driver's license, like training of when you are pulled over, even if it's for like a speeding ticket, when you're pulled over, this is how, this is what you should do. You should have your hands here. Like I wouldn't know any of this. I wouldn't know what to properly do. I've seen this debate on social media. Some people think it should be this way while others think it's we are innocent until proven guilty. So we should not have to do all these measures, but I'm curious to know what you guys think about it. And obviously, depending on where you live, it might be very different. Okay. You don't have like a medical exemption or anything like that, do you? No. Okay. Why, why is it so dark? <laughs> Other than it looks good. I don't know. I mean, I, it's, it's been like this for a year and a half. Well. Oh, her tint does look really dark. It's like blacked out. And he's checked it both times. Do you use one of the cards like this or do you have a meter? Use the card. All right. Carter's on his way here. He's got a meter. We can check it. Apparently, here the officer covered his body cam mic and tells the girl to call her father to ask him to change the tint legislation. Who's her father? <gasps> her father is someone of power and instead of giving her a ticket is he like Psst, i'm gonna let you go today but maybe you should talk to your father about changing the tent legislation i don't know what the tent legislation is i know that over here you can't have it like a certain can only go so far i have tinted windows but like you can still they're not blacked out isn't that illegal let me know if that's illegal where you guys are if you know there has to be some kind of Balance. You gotta be able to see in. I'm gonna spit on every nurse in that. I'm gonna make you charge me. I'm sorry. I'll show you how I get down when I get locked up. I'm gonna show you how I get down. I'm gonna make them be. Oh. I'm gonna make them whoop me. When you come to my mama, I'm gonna eat. I'm going out like a dang. You gotta knock my teeth off, buddy. And you're gonna get sued like a dog. I'm ready now. I'm all the way ready. I'm gonna show them how I get down and be off. Why? I'm a punch on the first white boy I see in there. I swear I'm going on my dead break. In the nurse, I'm going to spit on that. I ain't playing. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Watch out, watch out, watch out. I bet I get him on two on my dick. For Mason. I'm ready now. I'm ready to go to jail. First let us out here and come get who we attack. We don't tell that. Oh my god. Oh, he's just like hyping himself up for jail time. And he's trying to hype his friend up. 
but his friend is on a different level than him. I think he's just processing the situation a little bit differently. Um, I don't think this rant is gonna do you any favors in the situation. That was aggressive. Like he was talking about the nurses in there. Like, oh my God. All right, guys, I am getting out of here. Stay classy out there. Stay sassy. And uh, if you have a wig, don't leave it in your trunk. I think that's what we learned from uh, today's happier video. I hope you took more away from the sad ones too, but it's just a little emotional, you know? Emotional damage, as they say. I'm out of here. See you tomorrow.